In this Excel video, we're going to look at how to change the color of the grid lines in Excel and even how to remove them completely if you want to. Let's get started. So here I am in an Excel spreadsheet, a toy inventory, and you can see that some of the cells are outlined in a little bit darker color than the grid lines. And then we have the typical gray grid lines throughout the rest of the sheet. Let's look at some of the grid line color options that we have. There are people that have trouble seeing certain colors. And if you have trouble seeing these gray grid line colors, you're going to want to change those. Other people just prefer different colors, even though they can see the gray. So if you want to change the default grid line color, one way to do that is just go here to file and select options. And in the advanced options, you can browse down almost to the bottom and you'll find this option, show grid lines, grid line color. So if you want to, you can change that from gray or automatic to, let's say, dark blue. Click OK, and now the grid lines show up in a different color. Now notice, if I open a new spreadsheet, the new spreadsheet does not have that default color. So the grid line color that you set up is based on the sheet that you're working on. So that's one way to change grid line colors. And as you can see, it applies to all of the grid lines on a specific sheet. Now, why do these show up darker? Because they were already set up here in this drop-down menu to be thick outside borders. And so Excel automatically makes them darker or thicker. Speaking of this option here of font borders, that is another way that you can change the grid line colors. You could go here to the Home tab in the Font group, look for the Borders button, and then go down here and choose Line Color, and select the line color, maybe orange, and then you can draw a border grid. So I can now click and drag and select a range, and the grid lines within that range will turn orange. Okay, so far we've looked at two different ways to change the grid line colors in Excel. One that applies to the entire sheet, and then another that applies to whatever range you draw out. I'm going to undo that second one by holding Control and tapping Z because I want you to see that there are times and situations in which you may want to just hide all grid lines. To do that, you would go to the View tab, and in the Show group, you should see Grid Lines, and just uncheck that. And now all of the grid lines have disappeared, except for the ones that I established using this Borders menu. I'm going to put the grid lines back in, just to point out that it is also possible to have the grid lines in most of the spreadsheet be hidden, but not in specific areas that you choose. To do that, I'm going to select all of my worksheet by holding Control and tapping A. That selects everything, but I want to now deselect the parts where I want to keep the grid lines. So I'll hold Control again, click and drag to deselect the ranges, that I don't want the grid lines to disappear from. So with those selected, I'm now going to right click anywhere in the selected area and I'll choose Format Cells and I'll click on the Border tab. I'm going to select a color here. How about white? And then I'll make sure that I've clicked on Outline and Inside. Click OK. And now all of my grid lines in the selected area have disappeared while keeping the grid lines in the other areas. So those are some of the options we have for changing the grid line colors or even removing them completely. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this tutorial to be helpful. If you did, please like, follow, and subscribe. And when you do, click the bell and you'll be notified when I post another video. If you want to support my channel, consider clicking the Thanks button below the video. You could also support me through my Patreon account or by buying channel merch. And you'll find more information about those options in the description below the video. Speaking of Patreon, I want to say thank you to my $5 Patreon supporters. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.